Hey everybody, it's me, Peter. And I'm not gonna say that I nearly died earlier today, but <clears throat> maybe. So let's talk about mortality. Um, actually, let's talk about pie. This pie looks delicious. And I decided to get it for a very specific reason. Um, driving home from VidCon, coming out of LA, I had this small incident. Not an accident, but an incident where I was driving down and I looked at the sign on the side of the freeway and then I looked in front of me and then I realized that that car in front of me was very quickly approaching me. In fact, it was stopped, but, you know, relative speed and position, it was approaching me. So. I tried to stop, and that did not work, and I realized it was not going to work, so I swerved out of the way to my right, and I ended up going a little bit far over, and then I tried to maintain control of my car, and it did not work. So I lucked out, there was nobody next to me, um, and everyone else watched as I spun wildly out of control down I-5. Uh, eventually I realized that... I was sliding perpendicular to traffic while also slowly, yet very rapidly, driving towards the median. Um, and that was a very interesting experience because the only, the only thing that was going through my head is like, oh fuck, this road trip is not going to happen. But lucky for me, my car stopped before hitting anything and before anyone hit me. and. Bizarrely enough, it stopped in the median itself, like in the emergency lane, so I lucked out. Um, the person who I had nearly run into, who had stopped so suddenly, pulled up behind me, got out of the car, and they were like, oh my god, I'm so sorry, are you okay? And I, I was okay. I had to sit there for a few minutes, for like a, well yeah, for a few minutes, just breathing. Um, but I'm okay. My car's okay. Everyone's okay. So no big deal. Um, but driving for a couple hours after that, continuing on my way home, I realized that life is short. Um, and I could, I could use this as an excuse to just fall into pure hedonism and be like, yeah, life is short, let's have sex with everything, let's do all the drugs. And I don't really have any desire to do all the drugs. Uh, but, hi. I saw the sign for this place. This is uh, called Apple Annie's, and I figured a place like Apple Annie's has to have pie. So, fuck it. I'm having apple pie, because I am alive. And if that's not a good enough reason to celebrate, I don't know what is. Um, so that was my exciting day thing that I just wanted to tell you all about. Um, and let this be a lesson to you to always make sure you have an escape vector wherever you are when you're driving around 70 to 80 miles an hour on a freeway. Always make sure you have either clear side to the left or right, and you'll be okay. <sighs> so that's something. Um, ice cream. Oh, apple pie ice cream. So, also, uh, that's what's going on. Also, if you guys have not subscribed to my other channel, Go Verb and Noun, I would highly recommend it. Go check it out. I put up a video last night because I saw that Lindsay and Nick had tagged me in a sex explanations video from this weekend in VidCon, which was amazing. Oh my god. Uh, I will be posting a video or two about my video, about my VidCon experiences because I had a blast and I took loads of notes. I took about 13 pages of notes from like the 13 panels I went to. And yeah, I'll make... I'll make something out of it. Also, number two, also, uh, go check out my Facebook page, Go Verb Noun. Easy to find. Subscribe, because I'm on Facebook all the time. I have a problem. Uh, oh, and by the way, just so we're clear, that accident that didn't, that didn't happen, it wasn't because of any, I was not on my cell phone. So, have no fear, I'm a good driver. Paul, don't say anything. I'm just kidding. Uh, okay, guys, well, I'm alive, no worse for wear, and I think that's as good a reason to tear into this pie as any, so until next time, stay safe, mm. stay classy, stay awesome, I love you, and I will talk to you later. Alright guys, bye.